Now we venture into the epicenter of hot, Southern California, in the city of Duarte. Slaw Dog's owner, Raymond Byrne, is on a spirit quest to create the ultimate spicy hot dog. Ooh, that'll wake you up in a hurry. That's right, Albert. <laughs> I love how I could take a hot dog and add spicy things, add tangy things, add gooey things, and all together, it ends up being like a symphony in your mouth every time. Ray is opening people's eyes to all a hot dog can be, and he's doing it from his funky shop, set alongside another American classic, Route 66. I get to be that old-timey hot dog stand, and that draws all the great local uh, flavor of classic cars, all that classic Americana, the throwback of hot dogs, comfort food, all under one roof. You can build your own dog. Or pick one of Ray's taste bud torching creations. One of his most requested, the supremely spicy Hulk dog. <laughs> it starts with the scariest of all peppers, the ghost pepper. For the uninitiated, the ghost pepper is pretty much one of the hottest naturally growing foods known to man. We start with our ghost pepper sausage. So we have an amazing pork hot link, and if you're not familiar with the ghost pepper, it's actually the spiciest pepper available. I mean, if you want something that's gonna really knock your socks off, the ghost pepper in there is just gonna blow your mouth on fire and still give you all that amazing flavor from the pork sausage. While the ghost pepper link is grilled to tongue-numbing perfection, Ray throws some bacon on the flat top. But this ain't your average slice of cured pork. Oh, no. We just take our regular bacon, chuck that right out the window, and kick it up with a little jalapeno bacon. Center cut, infused with that real nice jalapeno heat. Another layer of fire comes in with a grilled pasilla pepper. That's topped with pepper jack cheese. Besides tons of awesome heat, we also want to really get that nice little crispy crunch, that nice little gooey comfort satisfaction, and the snappy dog all together. Let's add some grilled onions. This is just layering flavor upon flavor upon flavor. This Hulk dog comes together in a spicy stack of ghost pepper sausage, chipotle mayo, and the Basia Jack Melt, along with yet another wave of heat in the form of jalapenos. I know it sounds pretty sick to add all these different spices on top of one dog. You may think they'll just blow out your taste buds, but when you try it, it's incredible because every single layer of flavor is there. But still, you get that sweet, sweet burn. Ray's not putting on the brakes yet. Here comes tomatillo salsa and a scoop of habanero pickled onion coleslaw. Dogs need slaw. Is the slaw dog's law? This dog has layer upon layer of chili, heat, flavor, tanginess, gooiness, everything that you'd ever want in a spicy dog. But it is called the Hulk after all, so we need to make it angry. Let's get it really angry with some intense chili sauce. If you're scared of peppers, you don't want to mess with this one. One of my favorite things about the Hulk is watching other people's reaction when they first bite into it. That's the spiciest thing I've ever eaten. I'll see it too. I'll see it too. Am I crying yet? As all that heat from the ghost pepper starts sinking in, you see the sweat start to form, and you kind of wonder if it's too hot for them. Seriously? No! Make sure you're okay to drive home, okay? They're turning red. I asked if there's an ambulance on standby. I don't see it. <laughs> For another extreme blast of flavor, Ray's got you covered with the C4 dog. This detonation of fiery goodness starts with, what else? That ghost pepper sausage, along with some jalapeno bacon and a few tater tots riding shotgun. So we're going to add our ghost pepper hot link right to the fryer, and that's going to make that casing extra crispy, extra snappy, and I think even enhance the flavor of all the chilies and peppers inside. The reason we put it on the tortilla is there's just so much awesomeness on that. No bun can hold it. That tortilla gets loaded up with some house-made beer chili and a little bit of that ooey-gooey Ray loves. Cheddar and pepper jack cheese. Now we're going to take some of this delicious pastrami and that's going to go right on top of the dog. We have so many different layers of heat and flavor in this one that I also add an egg just because the gooiness of the yolk is going to make a delicious creamy sauce to help cool the burn. Ray lays down a few tots, the split dog, and some fiery habanero slices to wrap things up. Woo! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very spicy. 
spicy. Oh. Hey. I love eating spicy food because it just makes me want more and more and more. The sweat, the adrenaline, the endorphin rush. Wow. <laughs> Makes me want to just take a ghost pepper right now and eat it. There's a burning sensation happening inside me. I don't know if from kissing you or the hot dog. <laughs>